Excessive heat warning. I have an idea. Alright y'all, welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to be showing y'all how to change your line on a bait cast reel. Now having fresh line on your bass fishing equipment is pretty important. Uh, when you're fishing thick brush, rocks, Pretty much anywhere where a bass like to live, you're going to get nicks in your line. And that can compromise your line and cause you to lose a fish. So, keeping your line fresh and good, I like to change mine out. Pretty much almost every 10, 15 trips. Sometimes I push it to 20. But I like to keep it nice and fresh. Just to make sure when I do hook into that big bass, it's going to get landed. This is my Abby Garcia Revo X. It's a uh, aluminum framed Abby Garcia reel. And I'll be changing out from 20 pound mono to this cage line, 17 pound. So uh, let's get started. First thing you're going to do is pull the line off. So that's what I'm going to do. There we go. Now I'm going to be switching over to Cajun Line 17 pound test. Alright, so we're not going to overcomplicate things. You're going to put the line through the line guide, just like that. Put it through the line guide. Then you're going to have a hole in your spool. Just stick it in the hole right here. Go. Stuck it in the hole. It grabbed. Now we're just ready to spool it up. And then you're just going to reel it in. Now what you want to do is you're going to hold your hand and keep a tight tension on the line. So it'll go in there nice and even and uh, not have any uh, digging in when you're pulling drag or uh, it'll also reduce the memory a good bit. <laughs> That's what's going to lock when it's about full right there. Now, cut the line. And just like that, we've got a spooled up. Just like that, we've got a spooled up bait caster. Give it a subscribe if you like this video. It ain't nothing but to me, it's something. There was a few that didn't even bother With this old boy buried in the holler I prayed every day